So this is the third edition of our weekly China marketing news. It's going to be me, Tate, uh, Nara, and Lawrence, my colleagues. And here we go. So the first thing that we're going to look at here is this article that I found on Sub China. It's about Trump's WeChat ban. And it's asking whether or not this ban could actually take place. Um, you know, we talked about this before, and if a ban like this did happen, it would be bad for American businesses, it would be bad for Apple, it would be a little bit bad for Tencent, but they might not really care that much. Um, and it would just generally not be a good thing. We wouldn't really want to see it happen. Let's check out a couple quotes from this article and then discuss it. Um, what it says here is that um, besides inciting racial animus against Chinese, this ban has legal significance. By signaling out an app primarily used by people of Chinese descent, Trump's order is likely to contain a suspect classification based on race, ethnicity, nationality, national origin, and alienage. In other words, Trump has no chance in court. Now, the article goes into it more in more detail, and I'm not a legal expert. Um, I kind of hoped that what they were saying was correct and that this ban on WeChat actually wouldn't really be possible. But... Um, what do you think about it, Nara, Lawrence? My opinion is actually it's hard to achieve because if he really wants to ban WeChat, that would effort a lot of companies and users. And users. This week I did a research on the internet. I found uh, uh, some interesting news. The first one came from the uh, president of America uh, Chamber of uh, Commerce in Shanghai. He mentioned that the rule um, will effort not only companies in USA, but also uh, their entities in China, like Starbucks, Walmart, and uh, Nike, some other companies. Also, uh, Walmart mentions that 30% um, of the payment came from WeChat Pay last year. I think that's, that's a huge number. So in, imagine if the USA, they ban WeChat, they can't use the payment to uh, get some money. So users will uh, try other uh, payment or maybe if okay. sometimes... If they, uh -huh. I, I saw something about this too. I saw a, a rumor somewhere. I can't remember where I saw it, but um, they were mm -hmm. saying that if this ban goes through, it actually wouldn't affect American business entities or of course. maybe it wouldn't it wouldn't affect them in China either it wouldn't affect their Chinese subsidiaries or it just wouldn't be in effect for them while they're doing business in China I don't know I don't know what that means but but yeah I could see what you mean if if uh, Starbucks or other American consumer businesses couldn't accept WeChat Pay that mm -hmm. would be that would be pretty tough for them yeah of course and also some other companies like uh, Nike they also have a lot of Chinese users. They have Tmall shop, they have J JD shop. Also, they have a lot of followers on WeChat. If they can't use that, they will lost the connection with their Chinese followers. I think that's horrible. I also saw a, uh, a date from a data from a company, a research company. It shows that uh, the USA daily active users is uh, 19 million. And also in America, there are a lot of restaurants, uh, supermarkets. They are also using the WeChat Pay. Mm, if they can't use we, uh, that payment, if in the future uh, Chinese Chinese travelers they visit America, they want to buy some stuff, it will be uh, very hard for them because they must use like PayPal or some other ways to do the payment. So I still think it's really hard to achieve because it, it's really an uh, effort too, too broad. Not only for big companies, also smaller companies, also some general users like us. Sure, yeah. It, it'll be um, terrible for people if that ban goes through. Yeah. Um, you know, one other thing that, that I did here uh, is that the ban could be related to transactions on WeChat. And when I when I originally saw that I thought it meant financial transactions, but I think what it might mean is just any kind of transaction in general, which could be um, just maybe sending a text message or making a post or, or anything, any kind of action taken on the platform, which would also be really bad. 
Um, mm -hmm. I guess we, we, we don't have a whole lot of information on what's going to happen, how this is going to mm -hmm. turn out. So we're just going to be following this closely, but I do find some, some hope <laughs> in this article. Um, you know, somebody that has some legal knowledge is saying that it won't be possible for Trump to ban it at all. And I just, I just hope that's correct.